You're supposed to build a road, not sleep on it. Who are these poor <laughs> men, Micah? More slaves of Rome. Men who broke Almighty Caesar's laws. Some who couldn't pay their taxes. Like father. <laughs> Please, help me to my feet. If I fall to the ground, they'll hang me from a cross. Why are you here? I stole bread for my children. For that, you must build the road that leads to Jerusalem? For you, it leads to Jerusalem. But for me, this is the road that leads nowhere. <laughs> Out of my way! You! You work! Ha! <laughs> work! If it's rest you want, you can rest up on that cross! <laughs> No, Michael, Micah, there's you. nothing you can do to Stop help me. Get going. <laughs> Take that. No. <laughs> We've walked for hours, Micah. I'm tired. We'll rest a while. That man we met, that strange one, Gabriel. He was right, Rachel. That star... That bright one up there. It's pointing me somewhere, and I can't let anything stop me from getting there. It's strange. I don't know where it is I'm going, but I can't stop now. The treasure is close by. It's close. Very close. It was a dream. It must have been a dream. Get up, Rachel. It's time to get going. Oh, I'm so sleepy. Why do we have to go now? It's still dark out. I've met that man before. The star says we have to go. Come on. Balthazar, look! Two caravans approaching us. Perhaps I am not the only one who has waited for this special time to arrive. Hello. I am Balthazar. I am a king from the east. Caspar is my name. I, too, am a king from the east. Melkor is my name. I, three, am a king from the east. Three kings from the Orient, meeting at a well in the middle of the desert? Coincidence or destiny, my fellow kings? I believe the star that shines so brightly will lead the way. So wise for so young, King Melkor. I have waited my whole life for this star. I am old, but I will not die until I have stood in the presence of the King of Kings. I bring the gift of frankincense. I bring gold. And I bring myrrh. Let's travel together. The star points the way to our treasure. Hup, hup. Hurry! They know of the star and its treasure. 
They're kings, wealthy men. They don't need more money. Like always, the rich get richer. And with their camels, the poor get left behind in the dust. I've never seen anything like that before. Is that Jerusalem? Micah, weren't they at the campfire, sleeping beside us? Yes, now I remember. He's Joseph the carpenter. Make way! Make way for his highness, Herod the Great! Make way! Micah! The Romans will trample them! Make way! Now! Now! Micah! Now! Faster! Get in there! Now! Make way for Herod the Great! Get out! Get out of my sight! You miserable excuses for soldiers! Those horses threw the Romans to the ground, Rachel. There's something special about the carpenter and his wife. What did they see in her eyes that made them so afraid? Maybe they saw peace. Love. You sound like father. I'll tell you one thing. Love will never overpower Rome. Hurry! The star is showing me the way to the treasure. Come on! A baby? Your prophets and star have brought you across the world in search of a Baby? Yes, mighty Herod. A baby that will be known as the Messiah. A king greater than I? I am Herod. I am Herod the Great. Some say that I'm arrogant, that I am full of pride. But I say they're just jealous because they're not as great as I. Because I am Herod. I am Herod the Great. Some say that I eat too much, that I always clean my plate. But I say it is a gift to throw around your weight. Because I am Herod, I am Herod the Great. He is Herod, he is Herod the Great. They say that I tax too much, that greed is my ambition. But I say it's a small price to pay for a man of my position Because I am Herod, I am Herod the Great He is Herod, he is Herod the Great I am Herod, I am Herod the Great <laughs> Why did you have us brought here? My wish is the same as yours, to kneel before the Messiah and worship him with gifts. Go then, find the Messiah, then report back to me so I can go and honor this king. Rabbi, where do the scriptures say this so-called Messiah will be born? In the village of Bethlehem, sire, six kilometers from your palace walls. Centurion! Yes, mighty Harry. How may I serve you? Take your soldiers to Bethlehem. Go find this baby they seek. Bring him to me. Sire, 
If we cannot find this baby, then kill all male children in Bethlehem who are two years old or younger. Look, Rachel. <laughs> the star points the way to Bethlehem. The treasure will be there. I feel it. <laughs> Yay! Messiah? King of the Jews, is it? I am King of the Jews. How much further is it to Bethlehem? It's at the top of this road. Look, it's the carpenter and his wife. Shh, let's see where they're going. Joseph, it's almost time. We'll find a room as quickly as we can. A room in Bethlehem? You aren't serious. The town is packed with people coming for the census. But my wife is expecting a child any moment. She needs a room. How much are you willing to pay? Uh, we have no room here. Always open for you when you're rich. Money isn't everything. It is when you don't have any. <sighs> it's the only place I could get. It's fine. To find my treasure, it's got to be here somewhere, and I won't find it standing around watching some carpenter and his pregnant wife. you like you wanted. I'm tired. I'm cold. I'm hungry. What more?